Herbert Spiro. Herbert John Spear, September 7, 1924, April 6, 2010, was an American political scientist and diplomat. Born in Hamburg, Germany, where he attended the Wilhelm Gymnasium, he and his family emigrated to the United States in 1938, fleeing Nazi persecution. He served with the United States Army in World War Room II. His training at Camp Ritchie places him among the list of over 20,000 Ritchie boys. Afterwards received bachelor's, master's and doctoral degrees from Harvard University. The author of 13 books on politics and government, he taught at Amos College and the University of Pennsylvania. During the Ford administration, he served as United States Ambassador to Cameroon and to Equatorial Guinea, though the latter country declared him persona non grata. He later returned to academia as a professor at the Free University of Berlin. In the early 1990s, he ran for state and then national office as a Republican from Texas, but was not elected. Early life Spiro was born in Hamburg, Germany to Jewish parents. His family name is a corruption of Speyer, a town in the Rhineland which once had a significant Jewish community, but he reminisced that in the US it often led people to mistake him for a Greek American. His father worked for a distribution firm. He attended the Wilhelm Gymnasium. Despite the increasing Nazification of Germany, he states that in liberal Hamburg he experienced no discrimination whatsoever until after Christonet. His family emigrated from Germany just a month later. In December 1938, they passed through New York where their relatives had earlier fled before settling in San Antonio, Texas. There, Spiro attended Brackenridge High School and went on to San Antonio Junior College. In a news interview a few years after his arrival, he expressed his disappointment at the relative absence of Wild West heroes and American Indians in Texas, contrary to the image of the state that he had formed from the Western fiction popular in his native Germany. Formerly an enemy alien, Spiro was not subject to the draft, but after naturalising in 1944, he volunteered for a military intelligence position. He served with the 11th Armoured Division and received the Bronze Star Medal with Oak Leaf Cluster. He spent 1945 and 1946 as an administrative assistant to the United States Department of War stationed in Vienna. Early academic career After returning to the US, Spiro entered Harvard University. He stated that he had originally wanted to attend the University of Texas at Austin, but his mother encouraged him to apply to Harvard instead after hearing that a distant cousin had also been accepted. There, he wrote his senior honours thesis on Marx's critiques of democracy, with William Yandel Elliott as his advisor. He received his master's degree in 1950 and his PhD in 1953 with a doctoral dissertation on accountability in government. He spent the following year in his native Germany as a Fulbright Fellow and then returned to Harvard in 1954, where he continued as an instructor until 1957. He got engaged to Elizabeth Anna Peterson of Ratcliffe College, the daughter of Howard Celsus. Peterson, in February 1958. He received a Guggenheim Fellowship in Political Science in 1959 and lived in Rhodesia in the Central African Republic for the next year. In 1961, Spira moved from Harvard to Amherst College, where he was Associate Professor of Political Science until 1965. Afterwards, he joined the University of Pennsylvania as Professor of Political Science, where he remained until 1970. He then joined the Department of State as a member of the policy planning staff, as ambassador to Cameroon in Equatorial Guinea. In July 1975, President Gerald Ford nominated Spear to succeed Celsius. Robert Moore is United States ambassador to Cameroon with concurrent accreditation to Equatorial Guinea. His wife and younger son Alexander accompanied him to Cameroon, while his older son Peter boarded at Street Dolben School and visited Cameroon on his summer holidays. Spear's accreditation to Equatorial Guinea lasted only about half a year, however, as the country declared in persona non grata in March 1976. The United States had closed its embassy in Malabo in 1971 after one American station that murdered another, but still maintained diplomatic relations. Spiro and Consul William Celsus Mitherford Jr. had nearly finished one of their regular visits to Equatorial Guinea when Equatorian Deputy Protocol Director Santiago Anchama presented them with a letter accusing the U.S. government of engaging in subversive activities in the country and complaining about U.S. foreign and domestic policy, including the Vietnam War and U.S. nuclear weapons. A few days later, Equatorial Guinea's foreign ministry sent a telegram to the State Department announcing that the U.S. diplomats were barred from returning to the country. His posting in Cameroon lasted until May 1977, when he was succeeded by Mabel M. Smythe, the first woman in the post. Electoral politics and later life Spear taught at Free University of Berlin's John Fahrenheit, Kennedy Institute for North American Studies from 1980 to 1989. After returning to Texas, he ran for the U.S. House of Representatives in 1992 and in 1994 and for the U.S. Senate in the 1993 special election, but failed to be elected. His son Alexander married Vanessa Durrell Green of Potomac, 
Maryland at the Metropolitan Club of the City of Washington in May 1993, DC Circuit Judge Lawrence Silberman performed the ceremony. He died in San Antonio in 2010 and was buried at the Fort Sam Houston National Cemetery. He was survived by his sons Peter Spiro and Alexander Spiro, his ex-wife Elizabeth Spiro Clark, and four grandchildren. Works Reviewed by Henry L. Roberts Reviewed by John Hughes and Thomas R. Adam Reviewed by Charles Andrian and Stanley Diamond.